Hey everyone, hey everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats. And today we have got a little Costco side dish kind of item for you. We picked this up in the frozen section. This is the Pura Vida Fire Roasted Brussels Sprouts and Uncured Bacon. A mix of Brussels sprouts and naturally smoked uncured bacon tossed in extra virgin olive oil, Himalayan pink salt, and cracked black peppercorns fire roasted to perfection. This is a 40 ounce container of it and you get four individual microwavable steam pouches. Now their recommended method is the microwave, which is how I prepared this today because they literally say preferred method. It would not be my preferred method though. I would prefer to make Brussels sprouts in the oven. I do have a food prep ink video on how we like to do our own Brussels sprouts at home if you're interested in that kind of thing. But for the purpose of the review today, we will try it how they want it. So for those four bags, it's $13.99. So my question is, where's the bacon? Well, I mean, it's there. It's Where? <laughs> like It's definitely not as much as it looks like on the cover. And it's also a lot of like bacon fat, it looks like, rather than like, yeah. you know, the, the meat of the bacon. Yeah. And it doesn't, it doesn't look that great, which is really a shame because yeah. when I saw this package in the store, I was like blown away yes. because we love Brussels sprouts. Mm -hmm. And I saw this thing and I thought, man, like it looks premium. Just reading the description of it, it sounded amazing because whenever you got a problem, you just got to throw bacon at it. Yes. Your morning cup of coffee isn't good. Just throw some, you know, a couple of pieces of bacon in yeah. it. Your French toast ain't tasting that great. Bacon, mm -hmm. you know, just whatever. Yeah, bacon exactly. will fix it, right? Your wife leaves you, bacon. There you go. So, <laughs> so I feel where's like the bacon in this? They're, this is not gonna help, man. That's the thing, because I mean, Brussels sprouts is a freaking vegetable. It's not that expensive. So I feel like we are paying a lot for the bacon. And I feel like also, I like a crunchy bacon. Yeah. And I don't think that in the microwave, this is gonna be crunchy bacon. No, it's not. And once again, this is a Canadian company, which Ooh. Costco seems to love Canadian companies. What, yeah. about, what about American food companies, man? That's true. For some reason, they're just going to the Canadians. We can't get no love here. And guys, if you're new to our channel, basically, we review every day grocery items. So before you spend your harder money, let us tell you, if it's worth it. Let's try this out. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right guys, welcome back our rating system. Thumbs up right again, thumbs down we went at. So for me, this is a huge thumbs down. This is a rip off. This is huge disappointment. I'm really blown away because the star in this is supposed to be the bacon. There was like no bacon in this and the couple pieces of bacon that I did find, um, I would say majority of them were fat. It was just inedible. And then the Brussels sprouts, because that was mostly what this was. It was uh, unseasoned Brussels sprouts, hmm. which on here it says it's got olive oil, pink salt, blah, blah, blah. But you know what? It's just slightly soggy Brussels sprouts. It's not seasoned. That's what you're paying for, a bag of Brussels sprouts with really beautiful packaging. This is a total ripoff. Thumbs down. If you like what we're doing here, please consider sending us super thanks. It helps us continue to provide more amazing content. Alrighty, for me, this one is going to be a thumbs down. I and you love Brussels sprouts. We have them frequently. We make them at home from like fresh produce and stuff. We love them. And we actually have them basically like this, minus the bacon, salt, pepper, a little bit of other seasoning, olive oil, and that's it. This is so incredibly bland. It's a ripoff, like you said, because even on the cover, it's showing basically like the meat of the bacon. That's all of those pieces is like meat of bacon. What we got is fat of bacon, which I know some people love, but you know, and I, I like it if it's like crispy cooked with the bacon, but these are like rubbery fat of bacon, which is not good. I don't love the way that we cook the Brussels sprouts. I think that that was a very strange recommendation because it would be so much better in the oven. But also in order to make this better in the oven, I would then still have to add more salt, more pepper, more seasonings, more olive oil, which then defeats the whole purpose of spending $14 to buy their bag of Brussels sprouts whenever I could just buy my own at the store and do the same thing. 
It's a very strange, and I feel like this was made for people, because I'm sure we're gonna hear from those people. This is made for people who eat strictly for nutrients and not for any sort of enjoyment whatsoever, because this is not a fun dish to eat. This is a sad, sad Brussels sprout to eat. This is the kind of Brussels sprouts that makes kids hate Brussels sprouts. To sum it up, thumbs down, thumbs down. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.